simulator. Yesterday, Brandon had his science project do it in fifth grade. And his science project was a tornado simulator. And we weren't able to uh, get vid good video because so many kids were crowded around. So we've reset it up here at home. And Brandon's going to talk a little bit about it. We, 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 uh, we're waiting for the water to boil here. But even before the boiling water, you can sort of see the vortex, the tornado forming inside there. And the dry ice that we add will make it much more visible. But you can still see it pretty good, even without... That's just the steam coming off the, the hot plate there. Alright, we got the dry ice in. <clears throat> so it's formed a better, more visible funnel. It's kind of a big funnel. Okay, Brandon, tell us what you, what you told everybody at school yesterday in class. Look at the camera while you talk. Um, what should I start with? The, your experiment. When she like goes in a white angle, and that creates tornado. the sp the spin, yeah, spin. the spin of the tornado, and that's what the slots on the side of the box co create is the wind shear. In the northern hemisphere, the tornado spin this way, counterclockwise. In the southern hemisphere, the tornado spin this way. Clockwise. <coughs> and that's due to the rotation of the Earth. And, and this one is spinning counterclockwise. All right, we got a, we got a better vortex here. I moved the light down a little bit, so it seemed to be blocking some of the wind shear. It probably still is. <coughs> Your head's in the way. All right, now we're getting more air around it. It's spinning better. How's that, Brandon? Good. It's a vortex. It's not cold, but it's a vortex. It's a vortex, not cold, but it's cold, but it's a EF5 for me. Vortex is not cold, but it's That's a big vortex at the bottom. A it's actually a corvex. A big corvex. There is no such thing as a corvex. That's for a big tornado. That is one mm -hmm. big tornado too. And we put a big chunk of uh, dry ice in there. And that filled up everything. Now everybody's going to say, I'm not living there again. I'm not going to deal with that. Now, look at that, Dad. There's nothing left. It's a good one. Yeah, it's good. It's right in the out. It's smaller. I'm going to have to let it, let it dry out. I'm going to have to let it warm up. Because the dry ice is one, it's still one year. Can't see your free heads in the way. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think we got a lot of the storms in there. Nobody's saying I'm not gonna live <clears throat> there again. I'm not gonna deal with that tornado again.